Hello everyone, connecting with you today with what I pray is an encouraging and comforting concept. In the book of 1 Peter chapter 5 and verse 7, a familiar passage of scripture that is quoted by many, yet many probably don't even know where it's found, but the the passage reads this way, casting all your care upon him for he careth for you there's an interesting understanding here we we realize that there are two words that really are similar care and careth but they mean two completely different things obviously we know when the scripture says for he careth for you we understand that in its true definition, the Lord does care about us and is attentive to us. But the first word, care, which is given here, really comes from a Greek word, which is marigna, and it speaks to anxiety. It means the, the things that bring distraction into our lives, the things that really trouble our heart and the things that would cloud our judgment and would bring really great stress into our lives these are the things that the apostle peter is saying you need to take all of those anxieties all of those distractions and you need to lay them at the feet of the lord why because christ cares for you or he will carry you there is a a scripture in the book of psalms and the psalmist writes in chapter 55 and verse 22 and and it's mentioned this way he says having gone through life having had these experiences and found that god is faithful having this understanding he says leave all your cares and anxieties at the feet of the Lord and if this is the context if you do that measureless grace will strengthen you is it possible that you and I struggle to find peace we struggle to find the grace that will carry us because we're not laying down the things that burden us and leaving them at the feet of Christ, the one who can care for us better than we can care for ourselves. Oh, I I don't mean to intend for a moment that this is easy to do. No, rather it's something we must continue to remind ourselves to do remind ourselves that in the moments of great stress and being overwhelmed with the burdens of life and when anxiety and depression would look to come upon us we have to remind ourselves that we've been redeemed by Christ and as a result of his love and his favor that there is grace sufficient to carry us through our moments So today, this is the challenge. Will you, in your moments of of great anxiety and great frustration and distraction and trouble, will you be reminded to leave them at the feet of Jesus? Knowing that if you will, Lord, not my will, but thine be done in my life. Lord, I can't carry this. I'm giving it to you. And in doing so, that we will truly find that there is measureless grace then to come underneath, strengthen us, and carry us forward into that place of destiny that Christ has for us. So today, be encouraged. The God of everything not only loves you, but he desires to care for you. So today, cast all your cares upon him and walk in new hope, new found realization 
that He is enough for your life today. He is enough for your life tomorrow. He's the God of all sufficiency, and He's your God. God bless you in Jesus' name. Look forward to seeing you this coming Sunday. Invite someone to experience the same hope that you found in Jesus Christ.